guys draw the information. So you're given a focus. Everybody in this class should know that the focus is a point. Negative 2, positive 2. Label it focus. The directrix is a line. y equals 6. That is a horizontal line. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. OK. Now, if you kind of forget, which a lot of students do, think back to this or keep this. If you're given your focus and your directrix, right, your parabola goes towards your focus and away from your directrix, right? Does everybody say that? Goes away from the directrix, the line, that purple line, and it goes towards your focus. So is this going to be a horizontal or a vertical? Is it going left and right? No, it's going down, right? I don't know what the graph looks like, but it's going somewhere like this. It's going towards the focus. So um, there's a couple things we also need to remember. Also, in addition to that, your vertex, which we need to figure out because we need to know what h and k is, your vertex is in between. It's, in, it's right in the middle, right in the middle. So can we, find the mid, can we find the middle distance between our focus and our directrix? Yeah, just let's see. One, two, three, four. Oh, it's right at 2. That's my vertex. It's actually right there. So what is that point? So my vertex is at negative 2, 1, 2, 3, 4. That's important because that's my h and that's my k. Now, if my horizontal looks like this, here's what my vertical looks like. It's just the exact opposite, but my h is squared. And then again, Remember, Daniel, that h always goes with x, y always goes with k. I will mix it up. I have some videos where I make that mistake, Nick. So we've got to be careful that we don't do like the other mistake. So you basically need to know those two equations. And then we need to figure out p. So p is the distance from our vertex to our focus, which is how far? 2, but it's going down. So therefore, it's in the positive or negative direction? negative direction. So you'd say p is equal to negative 2. So x minus a negative 2 squared equals 4 times negative 2 y minus 4. Does everybody see how I plugged in everything? Then we just simplify. x plus 2 squared equals negative 8 times y minus 4. And then you're done.